हाउ आर यू ऑल होप यू ऑल आर गुड एंड डूइंग वेल एट योर होम माई सेल्फ दीक्षा राय दिस इज़ योर सब्जेक्ट टीचर ऑफ कंप्यूटर फ्राम एल पी एम पब्लिक स्कूल विच इज़ सिचुएटेड इन कोला बाजार गोरखपुर सो माई डियर स्टूडेंट्स एज यू नो वेरी वेल इन दिस वीडियो टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू रिवाइज द चैप्टर नंबर सिक्स दैट इज मोर ऑन टक्स पेंट वॉट इज द नेम ऑफ दिस चैप्टर The name of this chapter is that more on tux paint. So, dear students, as you know very well in your previous class, you have already read the chapter number six, that is more on tux paint, and you have you have already done the exercise of chapter number six in your classwork and homework copy, but still. we are going to again revise the chapter number 6 for your periodic assessment term 2 so let's start chapter more on tux paint tux paint is an interesting paint program it helps you to create attractive and wonderful drawings it has a lot of ready made tools that make your drawing experience fun while drawing you can also enjoy hearing different sound effects tux paint is an interesting paint program tux paint jo beta hai wo bahut hi ruchikar paint program hai it helps you ya aapki sahayata karta hai attract attractive aakarshit aur bahut hi achhi achhi drawing banane ke liye it has a lot of ready made tools inme bahut sare vibhinn prakar ke ready made tools hote hain जो आपके ड्राइंग को बहुत ही मज़ेदार बनाते हैं वॉइल ड्राइंग जब आप ड्राइंग करते हैं यू कैन ऑल्सो इंजॉय आप बहुत ही इंजॉय करते हैं हियरिंग डिफरेंट साउंड इफेक्ट अलग अलग प्रकार के अपनी ड्राइंग में साउंड इफेक्ट्स डालने के लिए नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द सेकेंड टॉपिक फ्रॉम योर चैप्टर इज दैट स्टार्टिंग अ न्यू ड्राॅइंग इन द टूल्स बॉक्स क्लिक ऑन द न्यू टूल नंबर सेकेंड Select an empty canvas. Click open or double click. The selected canvas appears on the drawing area. Now I am going to again revise starting a new drawing. How can you start a new drawing? Do you know that? How can you start a new drawing? There are given three points for that. How you can do starting a new drawing? Point number first is that in the tools box, click on the new tool. Point number second, select any empty canvas, click open or double click. Point number three, the selected canvas appears on the drawing area. Now, keyboard shortcut, press Control plus N key combination to open a new canvas. Do you know that? What will you do for open a new canvas? Press Control plus N key combination to new a new canvas. Now we are going to discuss about lines tool. The lines tool draws a straight lines. You can also create straight patterns using the lines tool. In the selector box of lines tool, all the brushes are same as the paint options box. To the to use the lines tool, follow these steps. Number first, click on the lines tool in the tools box. Select a brush in the options box. Then choose any color in the color palette. Point number three, move the pointer on the canvas. The pointer changes to a four-headed arrow. Point number four, drag the pointer to draw a line. Release the mouse button. When finished, you will see a pattern draw on the canvas in place of the line. Now I am going to again explain you for the lines tool. Point number first, click on the lines tool in the tools box. Point number second, select a brush in the options box. Then choose any color in the color palette. Point number three. Move the pointer on the canvas. The pointer changes to a four-headed arrow. 
पॉइंट नंबर फोर ड्रैग द पॉइंटर टू ड्रॉ अ लाइन रिलीज द माउस बटन वेन फिनिस्ड यू विल सी अ पैटर्न ड्रॉ ऑन द कैनवास इन प्लेस ऑफ द लाइन नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट शेप्स टूल द शेप्स टूल हैज मेनी रेडीमेड शेप्स यूजिंग द टूल यू कैन ड्रॉ फिल्ड एंड अनफिल्ड शेप्स द अनफिल्ड शेप्स हैव वन डे आउट लाइन बट फिल्ड शेप्स हैव सॉलिड कलर बैकग्राउंड टू ड्रॉ अनफिल्ड शेप्स फॉलो दिस स्टेप दिस इज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक फॉर ऑल ऑफ यू दैट्स वाई आई एम गोइंग टू अगेन रिवाइज दिस टॉपिक फॉर यू द शेप्स टूल हैज मेनी रेडीमेड शेप्स यूजिंग दिस टूल यू कैन ड्रॉ फिल्ड एंड अनफिल्ड शेप्स The unfilled shapes have only outline, but filled shapes have solid color background. To draw unfilled shapes, follow these steps. Step number first: select the shapes tool in the tools box. Step number second: choose any color in the color palette. Step number three: in the options box, select any filled or unfilled shapes. Option number sorry. step number 4 bring the pointer on the onto the canvas and place it at the center point of the shape then drag the mouse to draw the shape step number 5 release the mouse button once you are done the outline of the shape appears on the canvas along with the rotation handle rotate the shape by moving the mouse I'm going to again revise this steps for you. Select the shape tool in the tools box. Step number second: choose any color in the color palette. Step number three: in the options box, select any filled or unfilled shapes. Step number four: bring the pointer onto the canvas and place it at the center point of the shape. Then drag the mouse to draw the shape. step number 5 release the mouse button once you are done the outline of the shape appears on the canvas along with the rotation handle rotate the shape by moving the mouse now we are going to discuss about text tool you can add text in a drawing using the text tool to add text follow this steps step number first click on the text tool in the tools box step number second select the letter type in the options box you can increase or decrease the size of the text using the up and down arrows step number 3 bring the pointer on the canvas the pointer changes to a cursor step number 4 click at the point where you, you where you wish to type the text a blinking cursor appears step number 5 type the desired text once once done press the enter key now we are going to discuss about magic tool the magic tool lets you add many special effects to your drawing the magic tools has sub tools that helps you draw different kinds of things easily this tool draws bricks on the canvas to use the brick tool follow this step number first click on the magic tool in the tools box the pointer changes to a magic wand step number second move the pointer to the options box Select the bricks effect. Bring the pointer. Step number three. Bring the pointer onto the canvas. Press and drag the pointer to draw a wall of bricks. Now we are going to discuss about fill magic. To fill magic tool is used to fill color in an area. To use this tool, follow these steps. Step number first. Draw a straight line. across the canvas right above the wall using the lines tool step number second click on magic tool click on the down arrow in the options box select the fill effect 5 choose light green color in the color palette 
Step number six: Bring the pointer below the wall and click the light green color fills in the area. In the same way, fill sky blue color in the upper part. Now we are going to discuss about rainbow effect. This tool allows to add a rainbow in the drawing. To use the real rainbow, follow these steps. Number first, in the options box, select the real rainbow subtool. Step number second, in the help area, the penguin guides how you how to use the tool. Step number three, drag the pointer to draw the rainbow. Step number four. Release the mouse. A real rainbow appears on the canvas. Now we are going to discuss about grass effect. The grass tool draws the grass blades on the canvas. To use the grass tool, follow this step. Step number first: select the grass effect from the options box. Choose dark green in the color palette. Step number second. Move the pointer on the canvas. Step number third: You can either drag or click to draw grass blades. Now we are going to discuss about flower magic. What is the name of this topic? The name of this topic is that flower magic. You can add beautiful flowers in your drawing using the flower effect. To use the flower effect, follow these steps. Step number first. Click on the flower effect in the options box. Select any color in the color palette. Step number three: Bring the pointer on the canvas. Step number four: Click to draw flowers. Draw as many flowers as you like. You can change the color of the flowers using the color palette. Now, we are going to discuss about the last topic from your chapter. Is that saving a drawing? How can you save a drawing? To save a drawing in Tux Paint, step number first: click on the Save Tool in the Tools box. Step number second: as the picture saves, you can hear the sound of the picture being captured in the camera. In Tux Paint, a drawing saves as a picture icon. so you do not have to give any name to your drawing from this topic your chapter has completed you will revise the exercise of this chapter and you will i will send you teaching notes and exercise in your whatsapp group you will do this teaching notes in your pc copy when your school will reopen i will check your copy and uh, you will prepare you you will do the preparation for your periodic assessment term 